Welcome back. The year is 1091, and King Roger rules over a prosperous Sicily. Last time we assassinated the peasant ruler Thomas of Casenza, and also his child. So now we have extended our benevolent rule over the county. Okay, this episode's got to be all about Malta. We almost have enough gold to launch the invasion. I just want to look, search my realm for any generals that might want to join my court. That's it, really. Okay. Bowman. Bowman's probably going to lose this war against Venice. Serves him right. What's this? To the magnificent King Roger, your wisdom and mercy are legendary. We propose that Prince Adalbert of France and Mathilde Fitzroca should be should get betrothed. Why not? Would that get me any kind of alliance? Sure. actually form an alliance, so I'm going to hold off on that. The abbot of a nearby monastery has asked that you make a donation towards the repairs of the monastery church. Surely it wouldn't hurt to ensure that you're, you are in the monk's prayers. How much? 30. I need a... We need all the divine guidance we can get with our upcoming war. God will know that I support the church. What's this? Oh, rank up. Rank up to initiate. Oh, that, yes. Will we ready? Hmm. Order Neophyte Roger, I hereby grant you permission to advance to the next rank within the Hermetic Society. Signed, Magnus Fulmar. It is my privilege. Oh, I'm initiate. Nice. Okay. Oh, yes, yes. Queen Judith is already very fond of me. I'll move my attention elsewhere. Wait, who, yeah, who doesn't like me? My court. Anyone I could sway? Not rank, but, uh, no, these people don't matter. Well. It's not good to have someone with a negative opinion of me. Maybe I could sway Baka. She's a rival of Princess Emma, who's now a lunatic. Hmm. 900. Later this year we will. Oh, too cool. Count Bowman of Apulia has lost the city of Melfi. You bumbling fool. You bumbling fool. Oh, Sir Little, move your men here to Palermo. And look at some mercenaries. Nine. Gonna have to hire a lot of mercenaries. My liege, the people of Constantinople have progressed beyond our own technological level. I have managed to study their advancements, and the documents enclosed here should help us reach their level. I hope you will find this to your satisfaction. Wonderful news, wonderful news. Okay. I'm 60. I want to get a... Uh, how's my levies? I need to be patient and wait till I'm ready to strike. Because if I lose this invasion, I would have. 
Zikri Uprising. Hmm. Arjan's host has declared Arjan's host's claim on Sirti. But he's attacking the Cleansing Flame. Well, good luck with that. Oh, the Cleansing Flame has been severely injured. He's killed a bunch of people. The Cleansing Flame... Watch out for this guy. The cleansing flame. Okay. What's going on here with the Sunni uprising? Huh. 20,000 troops. Oh, I should pick an ambition? Yes. Build a great work. Okay. <laughs> anyway. We're going to go to war now. We're going to war. Well, let's wait till next spring. Hopefully we can wait. I'm in good health. Your dedication to religious pursuits has been noticed around the realm. Among others, it has quite impressed Bishop Nigel of Lentini. You have maintained correspondence on various religious and philosophical matters for some time and find that you are rapidly becoming good friends. Our common interests bind us together. I've got a friend. Another friend, great. I have three friends now. <laughs> There's more fighting. Huh. What's this? To the diligent King Roger, blessings upon you and your house. We propose that Andrea Ziani and Leseline de Hotville marry. Um, for 19 gold, sure. White peace. The revolt is ended. What? The peasant revolt for Rome is ended. Pope Honorius lost. He's just, he's been reduced to a bishop, Prince Bishop Anselmo. But hold on. What does this mean? What does this mean? What is... The papacy. What's going on here? Pope Honorius. Okay. He's just been reduced to these two counties. And Rome... Rome is its own... A peasant leader. <laughs> of course, no. They don't want to vassalize. Interesting. We can't claim it, can we? No. Interesting. Rome is its own independent thing now. And what's this poor uh, poor Bowman finds himself fighting Lord Mayor Omero of Zara. That's crazy. Continually have troubles there, Apulia. Uh We have a thousand gold. Uh, I will next spring. Next spring we will. My brother in the Hermetic Order, Janos, has stepped forth with an idea for a ritual that might invoke the presence of a divine being. The prospect of petitioning the divine itself for knowledge is tantalizing, and the idea was therefore received with excitement in the order. The ritual will take place in a few weeks' time. Circus of the world shall be laid bare to us. To Master Roger, my brother, I have a proposal which might interest you. An old letter detailing the possible locations of some lost hermetic writings came into my possession not many moons ago. If you find an expedition, we can search for these treasures together. Um, okay. If I accept the mission to find a hermetic text... Uh, if King Roger sets out on one of the expeditions suggested by Duchess Amalberga and finds an old hermetic text, the mission is completed. Um, okay. Live. Huh? Wait, who's executed? Duke Isaac Isaacios of Epirus was executed. Oh. To Master Roger, the letter mentioned three lost texts a tome in a local antiquary, a scroll hidden in a church in Syracusa, 
and a tablet in the ancient library ruins of Northampton in England. The further we venture in distance, as well as into the past, the greater secrets we discover. The choice is yours. I'm not going to Northampton, and that costs too much. Syracuse. I don't have much to spare. Surely a local antiquary will do. Summoning the divine. Oh, divine, pray tell me the secrets hidden throughout the world. My liege, the people of Constantinople have progressed beyond their own technological level. Again, uh, Nachman, you are doing a great job. Amazing job. The divine being has given me cryptic advice on the decryption of hidden secrets throughout the world. But with ample time spent mulling it over afterwards, I believe I've deciphered what it meant. I look forward to putting it to good use. The divine being has my total confidence. That is not, I have less interest. That's not doing me well. I'm just getting full of myself. Huh. As our, this adventurer is now imprisoned by uh, the cleansing flame. You don't, don't mess with the cleansing flame. Initiate Almoberga and I searched every shelf and chest in the dusty old shop. For days on end, we did nothing but breathe dust and leaf through boring old texts. They were full of nonsense. On the fourth day, I was thus incredibly surprised to lay my eyes on the symbols of the three primes. I think I found the tome, Amalberga. The Byzantine Empire is quiet. For some, it hasn't been that quiet in some time. Okay, Sophia. The Byzantine Empire, Constantinos the Fourth, the Just, or whatever. Okay, April. It's time to get to work. It's time to start this war. Siso of Sunni uprising. I'm not getting any younger. Uh, we don't have a full levy, but uh, we can hire mercenaries. And that's just what we're going to do. That is just what we're going to do. We are going to... Raise our personal levies. Raise our vassal levies. And uh, fleet levies. All the vassal fleets. And everyone will assemble. Constantinople. I mean, to everyone here, come here to Palermo. Um, I'm gonna have to raise my own ships. Hop on, get over here. Okay. A petty noble from Apulia has spent a week visiting Palermo constantly bragging about his wealth and estates back home, insulting his local peers and behaving like royalty. Your courtiers are quite sick of him and are asking you to take action. Yeah. Write a formal complaint to Kelp Bowman. I'll be happy to do that. Dear King Roger of Sicily, I feel insulted that the first thing you do is accuse my people of being ill-behaved. Did you ever consider that he may be a fraud? Of course not, you old jester. What nerve, this changes things. 
just put point on it. Okay, oh, these guys are still. Ugh. Come on now. I don't know where you're headed. You know, hold on. We've got a. Uh... Yeah, the, my Marshal Robert. He's good. Uh, but can I change my focus? Yes. Uh, I'm just going to do hunting. I need some health. And we are going to leave this army. Take over myself. I'm going to lead it myself. Torbin, is that the rough terrain? That's what it is. Aggressive leader. We need Serlo. Got some good commanders here. But now we also need to hire some mercenaries. Mercenaries. Five thousand. The Company of the Star. Monthly cost is going to be crazy. About the same, right? The Great Company. Where are they out of? I'm going to stick with local, be a little more realistic. I'm going to stick with local. Maybe two of these. Company of the Rose and the Company of the Hat. Lionello. And uh, Guidoni. And I'm also going to need to raise some more uh, ships. That give me enough. Lionello, okay, I have better, I have Serlo, and uh, 20,000, I think that should do it. We're going to hop on this. Um, and we're going to come down here to Malta. We're going to go over here, see if I can pick up, I need every, all the men I can get. Ah, Queen Beatrix of Sardinia and Corsica has declared Sardinia and Corsican Roman vacillation war on Prince Bishop Anselmo of Roma. Okay. What does she want? Oh. She's 16. Well, yes. That would be great. Queen Beatrix and Prince Bertrand are getting married. We can collect royal aid duty to pay for the ceremonies. Oh, yes, I need this gold badly. Sweet. This is a happy day. Before we go off and uh, possibly die on the shores of Malta, let's celebrate. Bertrand has married his Queen Beatrix. Let's check out her stats. She's already stressed. She's got a lot on her plate for a teenage girl. <laughs> Paranoid, temperate, chaste, wrath. The fifth deadly sin is wrath, Ira. And this character certainly has a hot temper. Well, well, well. Interesting. Okay. They're married now. Sweet. Oh, and he's... um. He's now... um. Florence. Okay, great. You guys are happy. What? She's uncrowned, but she likes Bertrand. She likes Bertrand. He's cruel, but he's gregarious and cruel. Diligent and just. Sweet. Okay. That's good to know. Oh, she's leading her own troops. And Florence. Hmm.
So I just wait for these 55. Dear father-in-law, peace be with you. We request that you honor your obligation and answer this call to arms against Pr Prince Bishop Anselmo of Roma. Well, I have to accept, don't I? And now, hold on. This guy. There. There, we got those 55 men. <laughs> you can have that for your war. We are invading Malta. Oh, Baca. Um, I will share my knowledge of statesmanship with her. Maybe she'll like me because of that. Meanwhile, while I'm in leading an invasion fleet. All right, 20. Here we go. Here we go, attacking Malta. I've got Serlo, my nephew, and my nephew Robert by my side. Meanwhile, let's uh let's give a commander to this. Um is Jordan. Oh, he's part of the army too. Turquil, Mayor of Rabat. Oh yeah, just go there. And meanwhile, let's get this war going. Oh, Baka answered to my letter admitting that she has much to learn from me. It was really appreciated me taking some time off my duties as king and leading an invasion of Malta in order to teach her something about statesmanship. Marvelous. Oh. You can stop sewing here now. Here we go. Battle of Medina. And, oh, our center has collapsed. Oh, no. Defeat. Oh. Okay. okay, we lost someone. Mar we lost our marshal. Oh, horrible defeat. Hmm. Or did he get arrested? Battle of Medina. That was uh, pretty bad. Hold on, I think so. King Niels of Denmark won some invasion. Now hold on. Yeah, oh, Robert. Seems like my guards have caught a couple of ugly fishes. Apparently, Adept Epiphanios, along with his accomplice Michael, made an attempt to enter my laboratory and steal my secrets. This insult cannot go unanswered. Perhaps Epiphanios is willing to trade a few secrets for his freedom. Yeah. Now hold on. Oh, I barely recognize Adept Epiphanios as I dragged him towards me. A few days in the dungeon does not does that to people, I hear. I'm sure I could have asked for his firstborn, so eager was he to have his freedom. Epiphanius filled notebook after notebook under my stern gaze. This will be interesting reading indeed. <laughs> now hold on. Robert is a prisoner. And uh, I can't do anything about it at the moment. The invasion was horrible. <sighs> Stand down. Oh, that was terrible. You still have a fair amount of men. <sighs> now here, I want to... I could attach these troops to... We need it. We can get a new commander. Abelard. He will be an able commander. And we need a new marshal. Abelard, uh, they're. That. You feel much better now. 
Oh, we we could have a new commander. <laughs> uh, he's a tough soldier. Gonoriu. These Sardinians, they know how to... Oh. Edamar. What do I like better? Two. I like Edamar, Mayor of Palermo, better. All right, so there's our... Those are our commanders at the moment. I want to make sure this detachment. Siege of Roma. All right. And just attached to the Queen's army. Okay. I don't really care about that. Uh, next spring. Wait, hold on. Well, let's go. Uh, we'll try one more. Next spring, we'll make one more attempt. Taking Malta. We're going to have to... Lo yeah, the Cleansing Flame. Don't mess with the Cleansing Flame. Next spring, we'll get... Save up some more money. We're going to have to have a lot more men this time. This is bad. We gotta, gotta retake Malta. Count Bowman lost. What did he lose? The Zidarian Apulian War for the coast of Apulia. What? So, hold on. Zara controls Apulia now. So what happened to Bowman? At least they're just back. He's nothing. He's been deposed. He's a nobody. Oh, wow. I will deal with Apulia later. I will deal with Apulia later. I need, I need to get Malta. Your spy master, Nachman of Abauge, seems to have friends and informants inside every Jewish community in Europe. Messenger pigeons arrive at his abode on a daily basis, often carrying vital intelligence from abroad about new weapons and tactics. Excellent work. Gain 50 military technology points. That is definitely what I need. I need to boost my learning here. Not yet. Not yet. Ah, uh, Cathar uprising against Kaiser Leopold. All right. What's this? Getting kind of old here. To Master Roger, my brother, I have a proposal which might interest you. An old letter detailing the possible locations of some lost hermetic writings came into my possession not many moons ago. If you fund an expedition, we can search for these treasures together. I think I can find hermetic text. Wait, do I want to do this? Uh, why not while I'm waiting? Find a hermetic text. Oh, so. Okay, the queen got another victory. To Master Roger. The letter mentioned three lost texts. A tome in a local antiquary, a scroll hidden in a church in Messina, a tablet in the ancient library ruins of Gorton in the Byzantine Empire. Well, again, I'm still dealing with Malta. Um, I don't have much time to spare. We still got this bigger problem. Wait, hold on. K 
Kingdom of Lotharingia, King Warner of Lotharingia. Okay, but it's still part of the Holy Roman Empire. March. Here we go. Let's see what kind of mercenaries we can get. I don't care. I'm going to borrow gold. Oh, I have a prisoner. Michael. Oh, this guy. Count Michael of Nicaea. 70 gold. Sure, why not? 